Hey guys, welcome back to Vanguard Motor Sales. Look what I got for you today. 1970 Charger. This thing is beautiful. We were just out driving it. It's a real RT. It's a 440 car. Looking beautiful. Love that paint. Man, one of my favorite colors right there. Looking sweet. Hideaway headlights. It's got good looking chrome on the front. It does not look brand new. It may actually be original to the car. It is in beautiful shape. And I tell you what, the paint job on it is absolutely beautiful. The Magnum 500 set off that paint. Then we got the RT on the side. Everybody knows not to mess with you in the Charger. Black interior, black vinyl top, everything looking sweet. You can see the upholstery on the seats is looking good. Carpeting's looking great. Door panels are in good shape. Everything's painted up in here. Everything's been restored. It's got the armrest in it, which is very cool. It's like everything nowadays has an armrest. Back seat's looking good. Even the dome light's working. We've got a good looking headliner in it. Dash pad's in good shape. Now these are all things that you need to be looking at when you're looking to buy a car. Thresholds in good shape, and that looks like it's possibly the original one. That tells you it's very, very well kept throughout the years. Love the fuel fill. Of course, I saw I saw a show the other night. It was showing Bo Duke trying to get in this thing when he was about as old as me. It was pretty funny. <laughs> he can't jump in him like he used to. Look at that. We got a spare tire in there painted up the same color, the jack, the lug wrench. Everything in here is finished off nice and neat. Looks like the light even works in here. It's a sweet unit right here, guys. Bottom side of the deck lid's all painted up looking good. Look down the passenger side. Straight as can be. These cars are so slick. That's why they were so fast back in the day. Just cut through the wind. Now at Vanguard Motor Sales, we don't do any consignment whatsoever. That means we own this car, so you know we did our homework before we picked it up. And then the first thing that happens to every car here at Vanguard is we get them up on the lift and we inspect them so we can answer all your questions. Now don't forget, Tom answers his phone seven days a week and practically 24 hours a day. You can call him anytime you'd like. Now we're bringing in about 40 new cars every month, so we've always got new inventory coming in. And make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit that little bell so you get a notification every time we post one of these videos. Let's take this charger for a ride. You want to talk about sweet? I actually just had this baby up on the expressway. This is an awesome driving car. I'll tell you why, I live 50 miles from here and I'd hop in this baby and drive it home tonight. This thing is sweet. It's the right color, sounds amazing, looks amazing. Really, really sharp car here. And we can deliver this baby anywhere in the world. You just give us a call at 248-974-9513. That Chevelle in front of us is one of the mechanics out test driving. Maybe we'd have a little race. <laughs> I might just pass him for the fun of it. Oh, it looks like he's chickening out. He's running off. <laughs> so Tom knows everything you need to know about this car. So call him anytime. He answers his phone 24 seven practically. And we can help out with financing if you need that help. Very cool ride right here. I love the sound. Now look down here on the dash. Everything's looking sweet down here on the dash. Looks like it's got the original gauges in it. I see that the tack's working, the speedo's working. Looks like the temperature's coming up. 
Now it does have the stock radio on it, and hey, you gotta look at the steering wheel real close. This steering wheel is actually leather wrapped. We've got a really sharp uh, vinyl guy, and he leather wrapped this uh, steering wheel. It looks stock. It's nice and tight. It's nice and comfortable. Beautiful job. And then on the radio, it's got the stock radio in it. So if you're one of those guys that needs to have a radio, I suggest you upgrade the radio. You can either have us do that or you can do that once you get it home. Make it your own. We've got a whole team of mechanics here at Vanguard, so if you see something you want a little bit different, we can do anything to a hot rod that needs to be done. And don't forget, we're always buying cars. If you know anybody that has a quality car for sale, hook us up, we'll take care of you. We're kind of up in a shop right now. We're at 15100 Keel Street in Plymouth, Michigan. We'd love to have you come in and check it out in person, but we do sell most of our stuff sight unseen. All right, we're underneath this charger now, and as you can see, fuel tank looks like it's fairly new. The exhaust is definitely new. You always need to take a look at these frame members here and the trunk floor on one of these cars. Look at the drop downs too. Uh, we got a Dana 60 in here, 354 gear, and it is a sure grip. Um, you can see the shocks look like they've been replaced. Always check this area in the frame too on these cars. Real good place to take an eye on. We got a uh, good looking, uh, these are Flowmaster mufflers, so that's why it sounds so good. Floorboards on the car look to be original and in beautiful shape. This cross member again, this is where the torsion bars tie in. You definitely want to take a look at this, make sure it's in good shape. Uh, we've got a crossover here. Uh, this 727 Trans is um, date code correct, but it is not the original Trans for the car, but very, very close. Uh, drum brakes up front, drum brakes in the back, and our guys pull all those apart, make sure they're all installed correctly. It looks like it's got new spindles on it also, new flex brake lines. You can see the bottom side of the motor's all painted up. K member, again, good thing to take a look at, and look at this paintwork right down to the bottom edge, looking sweet. Now let's check out these wheels and tires. It's got Magnum 500s. I think all Mopars should have Magnum 500s on them and they should be wrapped in these BFGs, 225-60-15s. Now, also, one of my key areas on all cars is try to feel around on that front fender there. That is a ledge right there. So this tire would throw shit up in there. So really one of the first places to go on a car. Um, the pinch weld also, that's where you have two pieces of metal pinched together and spot welded. It also is a good place to tell whether the car is in great shape or just good shape. This one is in great shape. We've got um, 275 60 15s down here, planting the horsepower to the ground. And you can also see it looks like they used a bed liner material in the uh, wheel well there, all nice and clean. Well, let's get underneath the hood and take a look at the power plant. All right, under the hood here, we do have a date code correct 197440 under the hood. It's got a Carter four barrel carburetor sitting on top. Uh, you can see it's got power brakes. It does have the Mopar air conditioning. Um, the radiator is also a Mopar radiator. You can see that little Chrysler emblem right there. Uh, looks like it's got a, a fairly new battery in it. You can see that everything down in here is all neatly painted, looking sweet. The motor is also neatly painted. Um, just everything about this car is neat as a pen. She's a charger, guys. She's got a 440. She's got a four barrel. Give us a call, 248-974-9513, and let Vanguard Motor Sales park this dream in your driveway.